Hello, hello, hello. So, as part of our kind of accidental Bikini Week <laughs> thing, um, we're doing um, Wickwaz Chainmail Bikinis of the Wolf. Now, this is a 7 base OPPAI version of the other Bikinis mod. Uh, but I want to show you the difference that makes. So this is a custom chainmail bikini mod for that shape. Should be compatible with any UNP based body and skin. <clears throat> I'm still using this UNPB body replacer. But you will see that when we put these bikinis on, that's the shape that the body's going to take. And I'm doing that specifically for that purpose so that uh, if you're unaware of how that works, you'll know. The body replacers, how do I say this? The body replacers really don't make a lot of difference in the game. That's the only way I know to say it. Um, they, they are what they are, but they don't make... You would think that the armor would be would always fit the body, but that's not actually the case. Instead, the body is always changed to fit whatever shape the um, armor is. So you'll see that when we do this and go through these bikinis here in a few minutes. I'm going to use Jade again for that because it just made the most sense. So um, Wikwa provided a good amount of pictures here. Uh, screenshots provided by someone else, like a mom, so there you go. Um, let's see, there's eight different colors, can be forged under miscellaneous, can be tempered. Okay, so really I don't see much else to tell you. From here it's still 7.22 megabytes, which is the same size as the other one that we looked at. So we're going to load up Jade and we're going to have her make us some of these. I keep trying to do kind of like refreshes and resets in between these shows. So just so you know, I try to keep things as good as possible. Now see, Jade is still using the UMPB body that we looked at earlier, okay, with the black bikini. See, she's not, you know, I've got her weight set middle of the road still. Now she's going to make these bikinis for us like she did previously. Alright, so we're just going to start here. You'll notice the light armor. And I think it's the usual eight versions. Now when we put these on, even though her way is middle of the road, you're going to see a big difference because they're going to take that OPPAI body. See how her body changed immediately? Let's see if we can do that again. Take it off, see? So her body is changing to fit the armor. And that's just the way it works in Skyrim. That's the way they made it. So for whatever reason, I'm not going to try to get into that. That's just what they did. Alright, so this is middle of the road. And this is the black one, and you can see that the uh, the BBP, the physics thing, is all there. And this is still middle of the road. This is not the heavy end. Well, we'll get into that in a minute. But uh, so that's the black and the blue. And this is a separate show from the other one because I didn't really want to combine them up. I want people to be able to see the differences and I think since I can't do like side-by-side -side video comparisons um, I just don't have that <clears throat> really I don't have that knowledge. Um, probably don't have the right tools for that either. It would be something I'd have to learn to do. So still the purple is too close to the pink. That is still my only tiny critique with these. I like the colors overall. That's the only it's the only thing I would say. I really like the silver 
kind of reminds me of Red Sonia chainmail look. <laughs> so you could do a Red Sonia type of character with these. Um, all right. Anyway, I'm getting off getting off topic here. So let's go. Um, let's show you. Let's just go ahead and show you the big side first. Okay, this is the big side. Definitely a lot more up top. A little more uh, booty, but mainly, mostly when they do that on this body, it's mainly up top. So I don't want to go too fast, but I don't want to belabor the point showing you the same thing over and over and over. You get the idea. Pretty, pretty quick, pretty easy. I've got to remember to take my pictures from the middle of the road version because um, that's what I'm going to try to show on my thumbnail. But of course, in the video, I'm going to show, try to show the extremes and let you decide what you like or don't like. Um, it's just all a matter of what people like, you know? We're all different. Not everybody likes everything the same way. So now the lower end of the OPPAI is still not that low. I mean, you'll notice you still are, she still has a um, pretty big chest and that's not going to change. That's just the way this body shape is and so that's the way this armor is. I uh, will show you what Jade's actual body underneath is when I do the small weight because I'm using the UNPB but that doesn't matter because we're using this this armor and this armor overrides that body shape and gives it this shape so your your armor matters more than your body that's what I'm getting at and you just have to understand that um, do you even need a body replacer then you know I really say no you don't you don't have to have a body replacer um, you just don't I, I think it's better to have if you know you're going to use a lot of UMP stuff, it's better to have some UMP body just to be, I feel like it's safer. But I don't have anything that tells me that you can't just leave the vanilla body and still use UMP stuff over top of it. If anybody knows of any time or any reason that would be an issue, let me know. Now CBBE is particular and it is a different type of body, so with that, if you're going to use CBBE, I think you really, really need a CBBE body. And I don't, I can't get into all the whys and wherefores because I'm not a, a modder and I did not code anything in Skyrim either, so I don't know why that is. But I get the feeling that that is a way more unique thing and that it, it has to be handled differently. <clears throat> Nonetheless, there you go. This is this is the low end. That's it. That's as small as she's gonna get. Okay. Nothing wrong with that. It's just the way it is. Um, let's give her. What color do we want to go with? Let's go with green for fun. I just want to show you that this too is temperable. I'm, I'm sure it is actually. Yep. You can upgrade it. And I'm sure too that you can enchant it. just take a look at that really fast. Now I am seeing an issue here and I'm going to show you that and we're going to fix it because yeah you can up you can uh, you can enchant it if you want to. I'm just going to do a couple of quick enchants and leave it alone. Alright so this is why we should probably use the same body as the armor body. Okay and I'm going to show you can you see because I just noticed it it's very slight let me see if we can get a better look at it. Oh, I'm too close. If you look at her, 
that's hard to see. If you look at her wrists and ankles, like you can see it on the ankles. There's a slight um, disconnect or seam. And I thought I saw it at the wrist too, though right now I'm not seeing it so much. But there is a weird distortion at her wrist, okay? And that is because I am not using the OPPA body that this was made for. So let's do a quick save. Because I think what's causing that seam is the fact that I'm using a different body. I mean, it's almost a guarantee, but let's just let's just fix this up. Because that's what causes those gaps is when you're using one type of body and then you use a different type of then your armor is using a different body <clears throat> it can easily cause those gaps it doesn't always necessarily cause those gaps and depending on how you're dressing your character it may not even matter because if you put on gloves or boots you won't even see that but because this is a bikini if you're using this, you're probably going to want to use that body. So let's just look at O. This is one of those cases where if you're using that bikini, yeah, you're probably going to want to use this body. You're going to want to use the body that goes with it. So let's go. Here we go. This was the body. Pardon me just a moment. I think I went too far too fast, didn't I? Alright, so let's turn this one off. Because we're using those bikinis for the OPP AI body, let's use the correct body for it, and that should get rid of those seams. So there is a reason, even though I say that the body type doesn't matter so much, there is a reason to match it up. <clears throat> and that's, that's the reason right there. If you don't have matching, then there is a chance that you will get those seams, depending on how things are made. I can't wholly speak to why that happens. But just that it does happen. So let's see. Okay, so now to me, yeah, see now those little those little breaks, the little seams are gone from the wrists and from the ankles. Now, to me, Skyrim always makes their arms look a little odd, so I don't see anything different there. There's no breakage. Let's um, let's go here. It really showed up. Yeah. Yeah, you can see that that's not there now. So, it is best to match your armor and your body. Okay? That is the best. Um, which means for me, probably with all the little Seraphim armor mods I use, I should probably still be using the Seraphim body. Uh, oh well. That's life. Nonetheless, I wanted to see, I wanted to show you the fix for that. If you're using an armor type, an armor that has a different body type than what you're using and you get those seams in the wrists and in the ankles you need to change your body type to match that armor type or wear gloves and boots and cover it up it's up to you either will work actually but you have to be aware that that's there and that that can happen it happens very easily it happens all the time it's not really a load order issue it's really an issue of what you're using and how compatible they are. Um, usually UMP stuff will go with UMP stuff with no problems, but like we say, just said and just saw, um, because it handles weight differently, the UMP B body is a smaller body and it handles weight differently than the OPP AI body. So, so it handles the shape and the weight a little differently. If you'll turn this off now, now this is with her middle of the road. This is what Jade looks like. That's her in her underwear with this OPP AI body. Okay. So anyway, 
that's a little extra um, that's just something a little extra in this video so hopefully that's a, a learning thing if you didn't know and uh, if you did know then well it didn't it didn't kill you to see it okay <laughs> but you'll notice the little break the little seam in the ankles is gone there's no disconnect there so and that's what usually causes it is some sort of incompatibility between body type and armor or something like that so you kinda have to get the two together and uh, get them working properly and like I said though there are ways to cover that up when that occurs and you're like well I wanna keep what I have so I'll just cover it up that's okay too that that works it's whatever works for you in your game okay but this really has been all about the mod chainmail bikinis of the north wait north or is this the wolf I think this is the wolf hold on let's wait till we get there since my mind has spazzed and lost it oh it's the chainmail bikinis of the wolf these are for the 7 base OPPAI body shape now remember this is going to be a bigger shape up top um, so if you don't like this you might prefer the other one for the UMPB where you can be smaller um, or more middle of the road if you prefer however you like it um, just remember from what we just saw that if you use the UMPB one you probably want to use the UMPB body and if you use the OPP AI one you probably want to use the OPP AI body so there you have it. That's the way it is. I don't know how else to describe that. This mod is from Wikwa. I don't know why I got off the mod. I guess I was just going to have us look at uh, Jade in her bikini again. Which, nothing wrong with that, but I mean, that's, you know, that's not usually how I try to end these. Um, but nonetheless, the, uh, the mod is by Wikwa. Gives you the eight different, um, bikinis and they are upgradable and they're enchantable so let's see anything else no I think that's it so all right and we also got to see how we can cause the little the little seam by not using compatible bodies and, and armor shapes okay so that's just something to see and realize that that's a possibility all right thanks for watching hope you have a wonderful day and i will catch you later